Hold up. Oh, it's that time of year once again. This Monday, after Monday Night Raw, we'll be going live over on twitch.tv slash Inc. with our annual WWE 2K Midnight Release stream. The stream you do not want to miss because you never know what crazy stuff is going to go down and what crazy stuff we're going to uncover and all the shenanigans that go apart with our uh, annual 2K Midnight Release stream. So join us on Monday, 11 p.m. Eastern Time on twitch.tv slash New Legacy Inc. And if you're not there, ooh. The following broadcast is brought to you by New Legacy Inc. Welcome back, everybody, to the Wrestling Games Grand Prix. It is Friday. It is 4.15 p.m. Eastern time. And the weekend can officially begin because the WGGP Championships are about to be defended right here on YouTube. I'm John Blood, and alongside me this week, returning to the booth is old Australian Adam. Adam, how are you doing today, my friend? The only Australian that matters. How's it going, Johnny? It's been a minute between drinks. The last time I was here, people were in cars. I don't know what's going to happen this time. Oh, it's a lot has changed since then, Adam. A lot of uh, titles have changed. Of course, uh, the title has been changing a lot recently uh, on both on both ends of the championship. Of course, in the WGGP World Championship territory, the current champion is Masahiro Chono, defeating Ultimo Dragon last week in WCW versus the World, uh, able to defeat Ultimo pinfall style German suplex. And of course, the Multiversal Championship has been going crazy as well. Current champion. Peter Griffin uh, able to retain the championship last week against Ernie the Giant Chicken. Adam, are you a, a giant chicken guy? And how do you feel about Peter Griffin? <laughs> I'm not a big chicken guy, but Peter Griffin sounds like a good guy to me. He's a great guy. Uh, very interested to see if he can continue his reign of supremacy. Well, let's find out right now, Adam. Let's not waste any more time. Let's get into the WGGP Multiversal Championship match. And here comes the reigning and defending multiversal champion, Kohog Zone, Peter Griffin. He defeated Homer Simpson uh, to win the championship only a couple weeks ago, and he's looking fantastic. <laughs> Real stylish. <laughs> what do you think of this uh, look of our, our, our king here, Adam? This is a man of royalty right here. I don't know what that implies, though. It implies that he's uh, the king of the multiverse. As I said, uh, defeated Homer Simpson in a unbelievable match, an all-timer multiversal championship match. Uh, defeated Ernie the Giant Chicken in a long-standing rivalry. Uh, finally putting that to rest in an exploding barbed wire landmine death match. As you could and, only uh, do. Of course, and Peter looking good uh, going into this one, Adam. If you were to grab anybody from the multiverse, Adam, who are you putting up against Peter Griffin? Oh. Tough. That is a tough one. Yeah, I know. I mean, there's anybody. I, you're, you're an anime guy. Any anime little freaks you put up against Peter? I think Goku would be pretty interesting. Goku, oh my. Goku uh, has not got a shot at the championship. We might see Goku stick up here tonight, but usually that's not the case. Like, if you spoil it, I'd probably be upset. You know that would I mean? be very disappointing, yeah. Well, let's find out who is stepping up to the plate here, Adam. And it is... Oh. Wait, that's... That can only be one person. And maybe not even a person at all, Adam. Meow. It could be only one little kitty cat. Coming to the ring to get a shot at the Multiversal Championship, it's Garfield! <laughs> oh my, thank goodness it's the weekend that it's not a Monday, because this could have ended really different. Oh, I don't know how weekend Garfield feels. How did this come to be, Adam? So, in our YouTube comments, Rory Gallagher posted a comment and said, Can Peter Griffin defeat Garfield? Only a match in Fire Pro can decide this. That is very right, uh, Rory. You know, Sprite's watching this one at home. Here we go, multiversal title on the line. Did you ever think you would see anything like this, Adam? Oh my god! Holy shit! This might, this might end a little quicker than you think. Clap the hands. He is stomping out Garfield. What a, a, a flurry of strikes there. And another big shot there, Adam, to Garfield. I'm a big fan of Garfield's tights. <laughs> oh, I mean, they're... Oh, oh, oh the Garfield slaps. Using those claws there, Adam, to, to just paw away at the hey, chest of uh, hey, of Homer. Of course, uh, Homer. Peter, excuse me. I'm all, <laughs> there's a lot going on here. Similar body shape. <laughs> of course. 
Uh, what do you think Brian the dog thinks about uh, Peter facing a cat here? Yeah. I I think he's going to have to hump some, someone's leg, I think. Oh, I hope no, no one's getting humped here, Adam. This is all pure battle. Oh, you want? I mean, you can hump me, I guess, if you want to. <laughs> all right, thank all right, you so much. If you really want to. Can't hurt that. Well, oh, Peter. <laughs> out. Oh. <laughs> oh, standing head scissors. This is a crazy transition here. Oh. This is an athletic monster the claws. Uh, this is unbelievable thus far. Spinning back kick attempt from Peter as Garfield throw and just slaps to the face. I mean, who do you have here, Adam? Uh, do you think we'll see a new champion? I think Garfield is honestly just so out of left field that you just never know what you he could possibly do. Oh! Punch right to the face of Garfield oh, and a... Oh, ass cheeks to the face. He's got pretty big cheeks, I have to Take say. This. Oh my god! Holy <laughs> shit! <laughs> that was off the, the, off the over the ropes, onto the apron, to the outside. A launching powerbomb from Garfield, DDP style. Shouts out, shut your mouth as Garfield really bringing it to the champion right now, but Peter is uh, gone through a lot. It's an exploding landmine deathmatch. But this is a back and forth battle, Adam. He always, Peter's always got a smile on his face. It makes me wonder if he's sitting in second gear. Oh, God, right to the groins. Uh, is, is, is Garfield neutered? Is that canon? Do we know this? <laughs> I, I actually have no idea. Well, double low blows and the challenger only gets a one count. There you go. All for that pinfall. But Peter, oh, uppercut to the throat of Garfield. I didn't know Garfield and Peter were the same height. What is he doing? Oh. <laughs> oh, you want to hope he's neutered after that. Fuck you, fat man. <laughs> now, hold on a minute. Garfield has a lot to say at all. Oh, God. Shoulder tackle Rushing. through the turnbuckle to the outside. Almost like a headbutt there, Adam. That was impressive. Oh, Garfield. This. Oh, another low blow from the challenger. He's really taking it to the groins big style here, Adam. We'll see he's hitting the balls. Hey, check this out. <laughs> oh my! <laughs> that is dangerous. <laughs> Check this out. And back the other way. Oh, just like a cat in the morning trying to prevent you from sleeping. Peter Griffin getting rolled on. He decided he to not take the cover on that either, which is very interesting. It's extremely interesting. And uh, you got to imagine, you know, uh, cat fur, uh, a big uh, problem. For, uh, uh, Peter seems like a guy that would have a tremendous amount of you allergies. Stupid cat. I was just about to say, <laughs> Peter Griffin does have a dog, but you don't have. There's never been a cat, so you just wonder. No. Garfield sitting on Peter Griffin's face. Look at that smile. Only a one count still, though, Adam. The champion. A uh, lot of fight, but goddamn, his cock and balls must hurt. Woo. Oh! <laughs> just ate his ass on the way down. Falling off the top, a hook of the legs. One. I can only a one count. Garfield's gonna have to to pick it up here if he wants to win this title. Oh, yeah. Jesus! Wait, the, yeah. wait, that's, I made that! <laughs> you did make that! I think that was mine! God, we're fishing too much, too! He knocked his block off. That was what it was called, too. It was. Peter. Holy <laughs> shit! I don't know what kind of training this man has gone through, but this is ridiculous. I'm, I'm telling you, Adam, you have missed a lot since your last time at the booth, and Garfield, no! Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Yeah, go to slap, go to uppercut, whatever you want to call it. Sends him into the corner. Garfield. Oh, Peter. <laughs> no! Oh, my God! What is that? F10? Like F yeah. F F10, F20, Powerbomb, Spinebuster. It is trading ball. Jesus! Reverse go to sleep. Trying to get Peter to take a nap. Double stomp. The claws. Not a, an undeclawed. That doesn't make sense. Cat. An <laughs> undeclawed. <laughs> Cover! One! Two! No! I don't imagine what getting clawed in the balls would feel like. I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that either. Garfield is just, uh, feeling confident there. He's doing tumble rolls. That means he's very happy. Oh my god. Oh. Ba barbed wire bat. Who's got the bigger claws? Oh my god. Peter swinging for the fences. Is this desperation? Oh, oh my god. What is this? Mother effing bomb. Oh, he's. he's oh! I'll ping on the barbed wire. Yes! So Two. Oh. That barbed wire bat in play. Of course, referee's discretion here in the W. Oh my God! He got last gift. Kohog's last gift. Oh. oh. The is gone. <laughs> TNA kick from Peter. Road TNA gosh. kick again from Peter. What is Come this, on. Adam? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Hot cam. No. Oh! Package pile driver from the champion. Ooh. Your back. 
Why did he land that? <laughs> this is unbelievable. The performance from the champion, but Garfield, he knows Peter's most important thing other than his full belly is a full I sack of balls. Not the, the full. Oh, he's, gonna, he's trying to eat the cat. That's not what you do. Jesus. Peter, no eating the pussy. Oh my God. Oh. <laughs> uh -oh. <laughs> Punches. Backhands, eye rakes, Garfield is bleeding. Garfield is bleeding at him. This is not good. Oh. Oh, He's got knocked off so far. Can he back on? Rolling clothesline. The balls to the that, chest. Man. Garfield going for the barbed wire, exploding back. All to the midsection. Oh. 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 He's hit him with the back end of it. Oh no. Gogs last gift onto the barbed wire bat! Two! No! Go! Oh. <laughs> Just decide. Let's see what happens. Two? No, no, not quite. Just barely at him. I think having such Peter. gigantic eyes on the face of Garfield is kind of dangerous. <laughs> oh, shiny hiney! Cover! <laughs> no way. One! Two! No. Do you think he farts in his face when he does it? I would assume so. Oh, jeez. Running, uh, rushing headbutt, uh, shoulder tackle, I think you called it earlier. Big boy Sentai That's from a Peter. big boy. This is, uh, we're at a stalemate here, Adam. I don't know what it's going to take. Gee, what an unbelievable theory of... Theory of uh, uh, <laughs> oh, tiny Heidi! Oh! Lots of delicious feet moves here. One! Two! Oh! Garfield is in trouble though, Adam. What is he gonna have to do? Something's gonna have to explode. Oh! <laughs> and a lumpy skull. Huge Larian from the champion. Going for a big power bomb. Last ride. Plant some, stack some up big style. One, two. Oh. No. How do you pin a cat when a cat always lands on his feet? Holy shit. Yeah, that's a good point, Adam. I don't know. Well, uh, Peter just landed on his back, and he's getting covered! Oh, oh, man. Any of these moves could be the end of the match. What? Holy Sweet shit! Sweet headbutt. Big splash, one. Look at that expression! Oh. No! Oh. oh, Garfield's in trouble, Adam. Back, drop, driver! Oh, back again! German suplex! No, it's power bomb! Power bomb! So NL special! <laughs> Cover! That's pin, gotta brother. be it's it. good for business. Two, three. And the champ retains Peter Griffin. Is still your multiversal champion. Two successful defenses. What a champion he is, Adam. He had to hit four moves in a row, which could have easily been a finisher in any other match to just put Garfield away. That was insane. An unbelievable challenger, but Garfield just goes down in the history book, says another competitor that Peter Griffin was able to put away. What an unbelievable showing, but that is not it just yet. In our main event, the WGGP World Championship is on the line, already announced. It is Kijimuto taking on Masahiro Chono for the World Championship. Stay tuned, but before we get to that, let's take a look at the history of the Wrestling Games Grand Prix World Championship.
And here we go. The WGGP World Championship has entered a whole new era. Is Masahiro Chono that guy? Is he him? He looks tremendous with that gold, Adam. He looks like that guy. And there's very few themes that you hear that just said chills down your spine as soon as you first hear it. And this is one. Yeah. This is the goddamn boss, Masahiro Chono, as I said at the top, defeating the Ultimo Dragon in Ultimo Dragon's first defense of the championship in WCW versus the world. Uh, Chono able to put him away with a German suplex. And this match, so big, so gargantuan, so uh, dinosauric. I'm trying to think of real big things. <laughs> Dino, that's like prehistoric. <laughs> yes, uh, maybe not. Uh, that we had to announce it ahead of time. Chono going one-on-one -on -one with Kijimuto. Uh, a match that I am very excited to see. Adam. Definitely two absolute all-timers just going at it, which you could say about almost any WGGP match, but this one is something special. Absolutely, man. And uh, I mean, the, the, the reaction to this being announced ahead of time was enough that we we're like, this is, you know, the right move. Uh, of course, uh, the game already announced as well. King of Coliseum Red uh, for this matchup. I, that, I believe, if I'm not mistaken, a first time matchup. Uh, for the Wrestling Games Grand Prix World Championship. Exciting stuff all around. Uh, Adam, give me your prediction here, man. Kijimuto or uh, Masahiro Chono? Who walks away with the gold? The best part about this is that you're getting something completely new and different. If you've never seen one of these games, prepare to be surprised. But I want to see Chono retain the belt. We've got to fit, we've got to end this streak of people losing on that first sure. It has been a, a minute here. You're right, Adam. The last few, I mean, the Hurricane uh, ending The Rock's incredible second run as champion but then immediately losing to Ultimo Dragon, who then, of course, as I said, lost to Masahiro Chono. Uh, this is crazy. And of course, we thought, we thought this man was done. Bye-bye, Muto. Yeah. No way. They sold shots Not in everything. This world. Not yet. Not in this world, Adam. The Wrestling Games Grand Prix, every era. Prehistoric, dinosauric. <laughs> Does not matter. What are you going to say? Hello, head? Muto. <laughs> Hello, Muto is right. <laughs> Look at this entrance, the pyro. Looking good, pay-per-view white and black gear. Uh, I mean, Mudo has not got a shot at the WGGP World Championship, but he was in the inaugural kingiest of the ringiest tournament, uh, which decided the first WGGP World Champion. Uh, Mudo was able to defeat the Gladiator in the first round of the King of Coliseum Two tournament. Then he would go on uh, to lose to Tenryu in the second round. But the man he is facing here tonight, the current world champion, was the winner of the King Coliseum 2 match in King is the Ringiest, defeating Tenryu in the finals. Uh, so this is a lot of a lot of interesting stuff here, a lot of callbacks uh, to the OG of this. Let's get down to the introductions. Team Two Thousand. 186cm、180kg。超能。赤コーナー。全日本プロレス。188cm、110kg。武藤圭司。I almost feel like the reaction's a bit bigger for Mudo here. It might be. I mean, he is a legend of the game. Maybe they're just stunned that he's back already. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> but here we go. It is Chono taking on Muto. WGGP World Championship on the line. Big fight feel here. Uh, Adam rooting for Chono here. Chat, let us hear who you think is gonna gonna take this away. Do you think Chono's retaining or is Muto the new champion? Big drop kick from the challenge. If we do remember anything from Ooh. the uh, Kingiest tournament, Muto really loved using his knees and his feet. And you might see that again True. tonight. He spam finishes like you would not believe. We saw Peter using that shiny hiney in that last match. Mudo definitely, uh, I imagine not. I mean, if he did use that, he would win, I imagine. But the shining wizard probably lined up here uh, if he can hit it at all on Chona. I like to think uh, Mudo passed that down to Peter Griffin and he just like, altered that himself. <laughs> you might be right. Uh-oh. What an attempt there. Uh, spin back kick. Of course, uh, Chono, not as successful uh, in the Kingiest or the Ringiest. Didn't make it out of uh, round one in the finals of the Kingiest, uh, losing to Daniel Bryan, but a worthy opponent, of course. But Bryan has not won the world title. So it, you know, it says a lot here about uh, how those things work out. As Mudo, oh, thought he was going for the Muda lock, but it just uh, wrenching back on the leg. 
Oh. Catches the leg. Dragon screw leg whip there, Adam. Sometimes with the WGGP, it just takes luck to get an opportunity. But once you get that belt, it does. there's no luck involved. That's all about skill nope. and determination. Of course. I mean, the range of games that the world title has been through. I mean, this is the 70th defense of the world championship. And, and what kind of luck do you need to have your retirement match and then get announced for a world title match right here? That's how we do shit around here. <laughs> Unpredictable. We're 330 in the match, still in the feeling out process, it seems. Both men trying to gauge where one another's heads at, trying to download that data as Jonah Big Yakuza kick, Mafia kick from the champion, and rubbing the boot on the face of the challenger. Don't do that. No. Oh, another dragon screw at him? Oh, no, oh. Kev, you blocked it. <laughs> oh. Collar and elbow, uh, sorry, Chono sending the challenger into the corner, following through. I thought another Mafia kick was coming, but he just All right. uh, running, uh, leaping kick to the head, leaping TNA kick, going to the knee again, as you said, Adam, working on those legs. He just, he just knows what he has to do. If you can do one thing well, that's all you got to do. That's true. Muda working over the uh, the midsection of the champion, and now he's ascending to the top here. Drop kick? No, oh, you're right, but <laughs> Chono, he's got balls of steel. He just took that right in the middle mid region and just flexed <laughs> on him. Drop toe hold by the challenger. He's already up. He's already feeling oh. it though. You're right. <laughs> Kick him up double balls. Oh god. Oh, and he's sending the challenger into the buckle once again, Adam. Yes, maybe Mafia kick in the corner. Oh! Quite the reversal from Mudo, and he locks in that single leg. And another oh, leg sorry. submission here. Maybe a, more of a knee bar, excuse me. Oh, what a shot! All right, now we're getting some palm strikes. This is interesting. Yeah. Fix it up a bit. They're really setting it up right to the midsection, and Mudo really working over the midsection, I've noticed that. I, I, don't, I don't know why. Maybe he's got something planned. You know, Mudo, bye-bye, and hello, Mudo, two different guys. This is Mudo V2. <laughs> Jono. Oh, another drop kick to the knee. Not able to put the champion down to one knee. Oh, God. Oh. That was lucky. Should have been Canadian Destroyer, but I don't think that King Coliseum didn't exist yet. Oh. The midsection, the legs, just uh, bit by bit, the challenger working down Chono here. Oh. Clubbing blows to the back. And I kick to the midsection. This is just back and forth. Uh, nobody really has a clear oh. advantage. Oh, he, fought. he did take out the knee. Oh. <laughs> that was sick. Vintage. Catches the leg. Clubbing blows to the back by Chono. He, I think he feels... Oh, off the ropes. Oh, he, I sent his left... Oh, God! Mafia kick again! Oh, focusing on the left leg. Turnabout is fair play. Working on each other's legs. I mean, it, it make it a lot harder for him to throw that shining wizard if he's uh, got hurt toesies. Oh, he's, he's counted that out of the corner a couple times now. I don't know if he goes back to that. He's got it scouted, and speaking of scouted, Mudo has that leg scouted. Another dragon screw leg whip just really tearing down the champion. I think at the beginning of this match, they both had methodical strategies, but it's just out the window now. <laughs> oh, big drop kick from Kiji. Oh, that was... Uh, 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 what do you call that? <laughs> I don't know. It was like to the titty. I'm not sure. Floor drop kick. Does that count as a double stomp? Uh, maybe, I guess so, technically. Jawbreaker from the champion. And he's waiting for him to get... Oh! Ooh, he was in position there. Dropkick to the knee again from Mudo. Oh! Shirty Wizard! But Chono's right back up! Another one! Oh, God! The champ is down! Oh, my God. Again? <laughs> he's dancing on oh, him. Oh. <laughs> he's got him targeted there. That's a threat. Slap. Spinning wheel kick from the challenger to Shining Wizards, Adam. I mean, that's... I cannot believe Chono's even up. How is he not even dazed? I guess he is a little bit now. He's just time for a breather. Both men down. Two big knees to the face is not good for anyone. Of course, referee's discretion here. Uh, but, oh, God. Great oh. Oh, driver! <laughs> oh, he's God. Done. How do you like it? Submission. That's Jerry Lynn style there. Not, uh, not God style. He, he hooked it after he picked him up. And Chono sending him off the ropes. Oh. Oh, my God. Yakuza kick to the head. That hurt him. He just dropped on the spot. That hurt him big time. Adam, he's going for it again. Going to make him oh, hurt. Oh, God. Oh. Grab the a leg again, does Kijimuto, but 
Chono had it scouted that time. Oh, God. Oh! Oh! Balls in the face. One, two! Oh, Jesus Christ. How do you kick out of balls in the face like that? I I would never. I would stay there. Big whip. Gets through leg whip. Again by Mudo. Looking. to. Uh-oh. Moonsault. Moonsault at him. Oh! Yeah. Pump the boys. One. One. Two. Oh, oh my God. Good God. He just keeps getting up. Turner just has the fight. Maybe going for the Mafia kick again. That Yakuza kick. If he goes for the STF, I think Mudo would definitely be in trouble. Again? He thought about it. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, the back of the head. <laughs> head. He's out. He's out. Check it. STF! Shut the fuck. It's... Oh, rope break. That FTS. Uh-oh. Chono. I, I, he's, he, he wants to kick his fucking head off at him. He, 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 learned, from, he learned from the previous oh! match. He just got to kick someone's head off. He's not done at him. Oh, no. Calling for the end. How many more boots do you have? Oh my, how many times can Mudo keep getting up? What is stronger? Why is him? The, the jacuzzi kick or the shining wizard? Uh-oh. Oh man, Mudo is rocked. You can tell. Ooh! That was, I guess you can technically the shining wizard from that position. Kind Alan. of. Oh, he dropped him down. Oh, he didn't fall down. Didn't fall he down. Tried. There you go. Fell down entirely that time. Mudo looked like he was going towards the rope, looking for the moonsault, but Chono out of position. He's looking up for his next game plan here. Collar and elbow. What is the challenge you're going for? DDT? Oh! oh the trademark elbow to the back. Just beats him down. What is... Go behind. Oh! Oh, our bar! Oh! Oh, man. Rope break saving the champion, potentially. What a... Jesus Christ! What a shot! Submissions ain't gonna do it, so I'm gonna just punch your head off. I mean, that works. Why not, right? Absolutely. Chono sends him on the rope. Oh, Mudo with the counter! <laughs> <laughs> Full on his ass! Single oh. leg! SDF! Oh my god, how quick. How quick he was able to swim two of those ropes. Spinning wheel kick blocked by the champion, Chono. Oh, They've shit. still been around the block more than once, so they know where the ropes right. are at this point. Oh, taking out the knee again. I mean, he's so his legs are so hurt, he can't even take one knee at him. Uh-oh. Oh. Ooh. Oh, rope break. Sucking on these balls. Yeah. Enjoy that. Kick to the midsection. Repeated shots there, Adam. Leg whip? Maybe. No. What? Oh, my. Oh, my. Crowned him! Oh, he did, he, did, he wants to be the kingiest again. What the oh. hell happened there? He didn't get hit. I think that was a desperation <laughs> move. He used all of his energy he had left. High risk. Shining Wizard! S3 there. He's now. back up! He was going for another one, Adam. Chono's back up! Power bump beating on the back of Mudo. Yakuza King! No running STF. required. STF! STF, Adam! Oh, fuck. This match is coming on 20 minutes. Adam, this is fucking insane. There, Again? Oh my god, that might be it. Is this foot on the rope? Oh, it is. I don't know if that, that looks is. that looks suspicious to me. Hey man, referee's discretion, Adam. We know that. Oh! He's not up! He's not sorry, he's up, he's not down! Oh, he's oh. so big! Oh my god, no! Yes. No way! Yes! Oh! oh. I wanna see it. 20 minutes gone. Oh wow, that hurt him. Go behind. Big bulldog. Uh oh. Mudo. Oh, sir. Chono. Blocking that. Off the ropes. Big kick to the head. Oh, no. He is near the ropes, though. Smart move. Got him locked up. That is such locked a smart up. move. Oh! oh! That is intelligent. Put in the way of the ropes so we can lock him in that double underhook. High IQ play. Super high IQ. Unbelievable. The champion. Retains Masahiro Chono, still your WGGP world champion. What a match, Adam. What you gonna do when you get in a submission like that? Absolutely nothing. Nothing. Oh, God. Watch out now. Come on. Discretion. Come on now. The referee's getting dis discreeted out of the ring. Well, there you go. That is it 
for this edition of the WGGP. Thank you for joining us once again. Too sweet from Chono. Make sure to leave a comment below as to who you think Peter Griffin should defend the championship against as well as who you think Masahiro Chono should defend the gold against. For Adam, I'm Johnny. We will see you next week, 4.15 p.m. Eastern Time, right here on YouTube.com slash New Legacy Inc. Ooh, yes, savages. I'm real as hell, brother. I'm as real as it gets, dude.